In this video, we'll show you how to measure the area or total length of lines defined by multiple measurement points using the Area Lines mode in the IPlex NX video scope. With the Area Lines mode, you can measure the area defined by multiple measurement points. You can also measure the total length of lines defined by multiple measurement points. This mode is useful for measuring the missing area dimension of thermal barrier coatings on turbine blades. Make sure that a stereo measurement tip adapter is attached onto your scope and that the serial numbers displayed on the screen match the serial numbers on the scope and the tip adapter. The optimal tip to target distance is one of the key factors that improves measurement accuracy. All Olympus video scopes with stereo measurement have the unique spot ranging feature that gives you the tip to target distance in real time. The IPlex NX video scope has multi spot ranging capabilities so you can see five simultaneous tip to target distances in real time. This means you'll instantly know if you are at the optimal position for measurement before you begin. The multi spot ranging indicator shows the respective distances at each of the five positions between the distal end and the target. You can move this circle or change its size to instantly know the desired tip to target distances. Press the measure button on the touch screen or the remote control to start the measurement process. Select area lines from the menu. Set measurement points. Place the cursor on points to define the area lines and press the enter button to specify the measurement points. The total length of lines defined by multiple measurement points is displayed at the bottom of the screen. When measuring an area, one additional point must be positioned to define the complete subject outline. This point needs to be located where the line between this point and the last point cross across the first drawn line. If you need to modify any points after completing the measurement task, select Modify from the menu. This gives you the option to modify the left or right image. It is generally recommended to only modify the left image. After selection, you can modify any of the reference or measurement points. Make sure to confirm that the modification made in the left image is correctly reflected in the right image. After you confirm your measurement points, press the Enter button. The total length of lines defined by multiple measurement points will be displayed. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please refer to the instruction manual of your video scope for further details. If you have questions, please visit the Olympus website or contact your local Olympus representative.